NASA is preparing to conduct a spacewalk on Tuesday, May 23, to replace a component of the computer mounted on the International Space Station that failed on Saturday morning. The MDM multiplexer demultiplexer is one of two redundant data relay boxes used to control solar cell systems, radiators, cooling loops, and other hardware on board the station. The MDM backup is working properly and the astronauts on the ISS are not in danger, according to a NASA news release. Commander Expedition 51 Commander Peggy Whitson and Flight Engineer Jack Fisher, both from NASA, will adapt and leave at around 8 a.m. EDT on Tuesday. It is expected that the spacewalk to replace the data relay box to take about two hours. NASA added an additional task from Fisher to install a pair of wireless communication antennas while Whitson replaces the box. Whitson assembled and tested a spare data relay box on Sunday morning, and it was reported that the new box is functional and ready to be installed as a replacement. Together with Expedition 50 Commander Shane Kimbrough, Whitson helped install the MDM which recently failed during a spacewalk that took place March 30th. The last emergency spacewalk at the ISS took place in December of 2015, when two astronauts ventured outside to release the brakes seized in one of the robotic arms of the station. Tuesday's spacewalk will be the tenth part of Whitson and Fisher's second trip out of the ISS.